morning and happy Monday. Welcome to week six. I've been doing this for six weeks. Wow. Last week's vlog is processing. It goes up in about three minutes. Um, and I just got finished adding in all of the books since Wicked Lovely. Read since I haven't added any of those in. Now that I've added all it into here, I've already added it all onto Twitter. I need to go and add it to my personal Facebook and my Facebook page. That's how my day has started. I did no reading last night, but I did finish the next episode in Life is Strange and Eddie is just messaged me so bye so the vlog is uploaded but i put it on private until four o'clock because that is my default upload time and i've just came to the conclusion that i probably need to do an unhaul because i have a lot of books especially on like these lower shelves that i'm just never gonna read and the fact that i don't have enough space in this room for another bookcase it means that if I want to continue buying books, I'm going to run out of space very quickly. So I'm going to go through before I go get some breakfast and take out books that I'm probably just never going to read. Also, I'm sorry if this these are books that someone has recently given to me or something like that. If I'm not going to read them, I'm sorry, I'm going to be honest, if I'm not going to read them, then I don't want them on my shelves. I know that there are a few on my shelves that people have given to me, but it's just not going to happen because they're not my type of book. So I got changed, um, but I now have three piles. Two of them are definite, just on hauls, and then one is a maybe. Thinking what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give myself six months. So now until January, now until March, so March 9th, I'm gonna give myself six months. And if in those six months, I haven't even attempted to pick up any of these books, and they're all gonna go. I'm not gonna bother doing an unhaul video or anything. I just don't need that. I mean, none of them are really popular books anyway, so whatever. But I'll show you the pile that is a maybe. So this is the pile that I have six months to try and read. Otherwise, they're all going. And then these are the books that I am definitely just getting rid of. I know a lot of them I've recently just got, but I just, I went through and I read all the backs and these three, I have no idea what they're about because I lost the, d the dust jackets ages ago. And that's just putting me off reading them because they're quite hefty books and not knowing what a book that big is about is just kind of like, eh. And then I went through and I read the back of most of these and I thought, I'm not, I'm not going to read any of this. I read of Celia because I've got two. The Vinci Code for the same reason. Um, getting rid of The Last Saint and The Berserk Reloaded because they're both sequels and I'm probably never going to pick up the first ones. Goodbye books. These are probably all going to go to charity or I'm going to ask my friends if they want any first. But I forgot about one shelf that I had to look through and I've pulled out one, two, three. I don't know how many more books but there's also these two books as well which I took out whilst I was going through them because Lisa gave me another copy of this. This one's a bigger copy and therefore I don't like it. And then Eddie gave me the whole series of this so I don't really need that either. But there are quite a few more books that I've had to pull out as well. So I now have a few gaps that I need to go through. Like these shelves, you can tell I love because they've barely been touched. These ones. At all the hazard. <laughs> so I feel like it looks a lot better without the books that I just didn't want. I filled in the gaps. Yeah. So these are all of the books I'm unhauling. This is my maybe pile. There is 30 books here and four books that have already been claimed by Tia and Shakira. Oh shit man. That's a lot of books. So it turns out Tia is coming around tonight. She's staying over and she's also bringing around Call of Duty and probably gonna play that all night or watch Sound of Music. Tia is here. Hi, Tia is. Around. Is. <laughs> sort of, not really, but yeah. Tia and here, right? Not technically. Sound they like sound they. like they Leave me and my happiness alone. <laughs> Tia has took a few books out of my maybe pile. I still have six books in the maybe pile. There for a few hours. I've just put dinner. I say just, it's been half an hour, half an hour since I put dinner on. Oh, that means it's nearly done. I think instead of giving myself a set time period to read this in, I might do the try a chapter challenge thing. See if any of them grip me. They don't 
goodbye. Hi. Hello. I haven't been in it yet, so I just had to. Oh, it's already downloaded. Um, we are now playing Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. Warfare. Yep. Which is kind of shit. Which is probably the shittest one going. Probably, but, but it's the only two-player game that's here. It's because she bought it. It's half past nine, and we're still playing Call of Duty, and this is probably all we're gonna do for the rest of the night. So I'm gonna end today's portion of the vlog here. I know not much really happened. Didn't get any reading done, but I have class tomorrow, so I'll see you then. Good afternoon and happy Tuesday, that sounds weird to say. I don't like that. Now we're gonna start this late in the day again. We were running late this morning so I didn't start the vlog even though I got montage clips that I'm probably not gonna put in because that just doesn't make sense. So I'm home from college class now and Tia's been home from college for like four hours. Five hours. Five hours. Today was a weird day, I don't know what was going on, but I didn't do any reading on the bus again. It's just becoming a pattern now, but she read Twilight, and she's now reading the selection as you can see. And I'm gonna read The Blue Lady, since she'll ignore me for the, until she finishes it, so I might as well. Oh. <laughs> so, are you liking it? Yeah, I'm like really in love with this book. What thoughts are you, have you got so far? That I'm in love with Maxim. Yes. But Travis Same. is my babe, so I can't. Well, yeah, but you that. can still be in love with I'm someone. I'm just saying. Just saying, Travis um, is from Beautiful Disaster. disaster. He's my babe. I really like America. Aspen's a dickhead. I liked him in the beginning, but then he was like, no, I can't do this. Aspen. And I was like, no! Hang on. Because I read it so fast, I have to clarify. Aspen's the dude that she was with in the beginning, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah. But yeah, I'm going to go read this while she's finishing off that. She will literally finish that in like less than an hour, probably. pretty much just been a really shitty vlogging day for me. I didn't have a chance to vlog this morning. I don't vlog. Why is I'm... my sister so bad at Snapchatting people? Sorry. Yes, Kira, why are you so bad at Snapchatting people? <laughs> I don't vlog at college regardless. I got home. I vlogged when I got home. I did. I did that. Uh, we did some reading and then we just kind of sat there and did nothing. Direction, we had takeaway. It was great. The red. 65 pages of the blue lady it's just starting to get into the ghostly things they just did the first ouija board shit there used to be a paper and a coin what are you doing she finished the selection i did the first one how did you like it i loved it I can really you did. look at the camera no because i'm doing this i don't want to get into too much detail because i'll start ranting about it favorite character mm, i've got to say america i know she's the main but i really like that her very obvious answer yeah and that's that Guess what we're doing? Totally not doing what we were doing yesterday. <laughs> so I'm gonna end today's portion of the vlog here and I will see you tomorrow. Good morning and happy Wednesday. Still asleep, but I have to go to the job centres. I'm also gonna take down the pile of books that need to go to a charity shop. Down there, it's really heavy. So let's go. Now I'm home. No updates. I genuinely went to the job centre and took the books to the charity shop and that's it. The bag was really, really heavy. Like, really heavy. Took it to my favourite one where I always buy my books from. Tia's just woken up. I feel like Tia doing... got woken up. It's nearly two o'clock. Yeah, and it's my day off. I deserve it. Tia needed waking up because we went to bed at like midnight. You've had 13 hours sleep. I just got a package. It's a Michael Jackson mug because Sheena really, really likes Michael Jackson. has gone home now i'm all on my own and i think i'm gonna do a little bit of reading after i've watched some youtube because it's raining and it's really peaceful and calm and i want to get into bed because i'm cold i also realized after i click literally instantly after i clicked publish that it's actually wednesday today and i didn't need to upload but 
I mean, what can I do? I've already done it. So I put it on private before it got any views. The only view was the one of, of me opening it. So it's free scheduled uploaded for tomorrow, which is great. I just went for a shower I did some reading beforehand and got to page 107 which means I read 42 pages I'm about to put Netflix on as background noise read some more until I'm too tired to continue to do so and then I'm gonna go to bed so that is it for today's portion of the vlog and I will see you tomorrow good morning and happy Thursday I am gonna try to vlog a little more today because I feel like I haven't vlogged much this week However, I do still have class and I can't really vlog that much in there. So I look really tired today and this spot here is just claiming dominance over my face. Now, I wish I had my full fringe so I could just whoop. Wait, maybe I'll go that side today. It kind of covers it. I kind of like that better. Okay, so I'm off to class and I will see you later. I feel like I did a lot of reading today and I'm not really sure if I have. I picked up the blue lady when I was on the bus but first I need to update you on last night actually. Started on page 65 last night. Pretty sure I read to this chapter which made page 175 which means last night I read 110 pages and today I read to 245 but it's a mid chapter page I literally just got off the bus mid chapter and I was like no so on the way there I read from page 175 to 205 and that is 30 pages and then on the way back I read to page 245 and that is 40 pages so 70 pages on the bus today there and back and usually I read around 50 there and back so I read an extra 20 pages I'm getting through this book really really quickly all of the Goodreads editions go up to around like 200 pages and this edition goes up to 294 pages so now that I have surpassed how many pages it actually says there is I can't update where I'm at but I feel like I could probably read the rest within one sitting so I'm not going to update until I'm finished it basically and to do after I've finished updating because I'm in the middle of a chapter and that's really annoying and also there's like 50 pages left, 49 pages left, um, but an update about what happened before I got on the bus home. I went into the works, this is every time I go to college now I just kind of go into works because my college is literally around the corner, I have to pass the works to get and get my bus, so every time that I go to college I kind of just have a little browse around the works and they've got the If I Stay trilogy, I'm pretty sure If I Stay is a duology and the third book is just another book. I got this which is If I Stay Where She Went In Just One Day by Gail Foreman. If you don't know I read If I Stay I think sometime in the beginning of this year. I can't remember when it was but it was sometime this year. I know it wasn't last year and I wanted to get a physical copy of it for myself but I couldn't find it literally anywhere and picked up all three for seven pound which is amazing. I love the work so much so yeah I picked these up. I just have to find a place on my bookshelf for them because I've organised it very tightly. I'm thinking maybe next to everything everything that would make sense. I don't know I'll work it out. And then I also got some paint brushes because last night I was messing around with my paints and I only have one brush so I picked up some more. So that's my little update. I'm now going to probably read this until the finish. I have 50 minutes before I need to 
put the video on to upload and I have 49 pages. So if I can time this perfectly, I can finish this and upload the video straight away. So I'll see you when I'm doing that. So I finished the book and it's 3.51 so I have 9 minutes until I can publish my video so I thought I'd give you a little update. Yes, it's definitely a ghost story but it is also a romance story which is kind of cute actually. I kind of really did like the romance in this. It didn't scare me like it should have done. Um, which didn't really bother me. I don't really get scared easily anyway. I really liked the story. The ending though, however, like the actual ending was really good. But the last chapter, the epilogue, was just kind of like, what? And you're not really sure on what happens at the end. Because she says that she can either go one way or the other. And then she says she starts to walk and that's it. It doesn't say which way she goes. So I'm going to take it as she went the way I want her to go. Because I want that ending. I, I want that ending. And I'm going to give it enjoyability of a 3.5 five star out of five just because it was really easy to read however it was just kind of put in an eye roll it could have been a lot scarier could have been focused more on the ghostly side to it rather than the boyfriendy side of it but i did really like it now i'm gonna upload this video so the video is now up i've put if i stay there and i feel like they look really nice and i moved the fifth wave up there i'm not sure if i'm happy about that placement of the fifth wave but i am happy with that there i feel like it looks really nice and it goes really well so the video is now up i have changed into pajamas i'm also in bed and watching youtube i currently have a clockwork reader on and i'm just chilling i don't really have any more plans for tonight i might start an iron witch but I have a headache at the minute, so I'm not sure if that's something I'm going to do. I want to read something vampire-y, but the only vampire books I know I have is Twilight and the Cirque du Freak series. I recently already read Twilight last year and I read the whole Cirque du Freak saga last year, so I'm not sure. I've literally been sat here for the past like four hours just watching youtube and netflix and my headache is still here i said four hours in life it's been more like two i don't know but it's now like eight o'clock and i still have a headache so i'm probably just gonna go to sleep and yeah i will see you in tomorrow's portion of the vlog good morning and happy friday i am ready i am dressed i actually don't need to go into class today because I did all of my work yesterday but I decided that I was going to anyway just to see if there's anything else I can do, if there's anything I haven't finished so far um, and if not I'm also going to be taking my book and I'm going to be taking some of my writing planning things for my next book which is called Parallel if you don't know my book Alternate which is the first book in the trilogy is already out and the link is always in the description of every single video I post so if you haven't read it go and check it out because it's an amazing book, obviously. Um, it's completely free, you just need to sign up to the website Wattpad and there's a lot more books on there that are a great read. Shakira's book's also on there. It's just, it's a great place. Wattpad is an amazing place for young writers that don't have the money to be published but still want their books to be read. So um, I'm going to be taking my book and I'm going to be taking my reading book, by the way. I'm going to be taking my reading book and I'm going to be taking some writing stuff so if I have nothing to do I can just sit there and plan. So that being said, I'm about to leave and I will see you guys later. For those of you that don't know, there is a readathon tomorrow hosted by Read by Zoe and it's the Halloween readathon. I called it the Halloween readathon because A, it's in the month of Halloween, and B, it's in October. Like, 
they were the same points what am i doing basically in the month of october and this is the time where people are usually reading those spooky books however she did say you can read whatever you want so um i'm trying to put together a little tbr now but i am failing because i don't really have that many books that are spooky themed and i want to keep to the halloween theme but I will be taking part in the 24 hour readathon. There won't be a Saturday for this vlog and I feel like this vlog is going to be quite small. I don't know because I haven't actually like sat down and imported any of the footage yet. But I have a feeling it's going to be at least slightly smaller. I'm making a separate video on this that's going to go up next thursday but there will actually be a vlog for saturday it's just going to be uploaded on thursday it's a separate video because it'll be the 24 hour readathon video with that in mind because i'm going to be reading for 24 hours straight well probably not reading for 24 hours straight but i'm gonna be awake for 24 hours straight i'm gonna try to stay awake for 24 hours straight anyway um i'm actually going to take a nap soon and then the next thing you know it's going to be the next video so this may be the last clip you see so this is it for today's portion of the vlog and i will see you on sunday good morning and happy sunday it's not morning now it's 12 30 <laughs> but i've been awake since like nine it counts um as you can hear tia is here she came last night because during the readathon both of my neighbors decided they wanted to fight and have a party and find out who can play the music the loudest and at one point i was listening to the macarena as well as is this the way to amarillo at the same time <laughs> really loudly i could not focus on reading at all but i finished two books and if you want to go and see that video it will be uploaded on thursday um i also started the iron witch would you believe it i've been putting this off for days but i only got 14 pages in because i couldn't focus on reading for the last eight or so hours of the read along i just didn't read anything because neighbors are annoying as fuck and then when they finally died down tia was already here so i was just like eh. i think that's all the updates because if you want to see what happened yesterday you can go and watch the video which will be up on thursday but i'll update you later when something happens okay so that was a little bit of a poop i just didn't update you all day and now it's 9 30 pm and i'm about to end this vlog but me and tia played trivial pursuit and call of duty infinite warfare which is actually really great our opinion on that was so wrong it's really fun to play um and then i went around tears and shakira's and i had some dinner with them we had roast dinner chicken roast dinner it was great i love sheena's roast it's amazing um and then we talked about shakira and tears birthday party which is coming up in december and then we had a bit of a laugh about really old um drunk stories the first time me and shakira got drunk together we went back and watched that snapchat it was really funny and now i'm home and i need to edit this vlog because it needs to go up tomorrow and we know what my internet is like so i could go around to yours and shakira's to upload it they did offer me to do that so that is it for this week's vlog and i will see you tomorrow for next week's vlog um if you enjoyed this vlog please go ahead and give it a big thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already i love you all so much to infinity and beyond Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed. My name is Waverly and now I'm off to read while well, I'm going to edit. <laughs> Bye!